Hey, my name is Bobby. I'm the campus editor at the Northern Star here. Um, for tomorrow's issue, um, I have a brief coming in uh, on the mayoral, uh, mayoral debate um, and the student association uh, debates, which are tomorrow night um, in the student center. And then Newell has an article on the uh, STEM uh, event um, on campus tonight. That's all from uh, campus. Hi, my name is Jesse Hache, and I'm the day editor at the Northern Star. Uh, for some of our day stories today, we have a story about Breakfast with the Bunny, which is an event this Saturday at the Egyptian Theater. The families can go out and have breakfast with the Easter Bunny. Uh, we also have some event coverage on From Cards to Cultural Understanding, which was an event put on by the Human Resource Services today. Uh, we also have a story about Robert Albanese and how he um, accepted a plea deal today saying he was guilty in his part of the coffee fund case. And finally, we have a student spotlight on Jamelia, Jamelia Cartman. How's it going, guys? I'm Jake Gornack. I'm the sports editor of Northern Star. And for today's paper, we have a men's basketball season recap, a feature on gymnastics junior Kim Gotland, a uh, column on the women's basketball season, and we also have a feature on um, hurdles, techni hurdles techniques for track and field, as well as a March Madness column. Hi, I'm Jen Weddle, and for scene we have Amy covering the APO silent auction. We have Olivia, who's going to talk about Dubai fashion. She went there for spring break. And we have uh, Josh covering two gaming related articles. One is 99Gamers, which is a website where you can trade your games with other players. And he's doing games that are coming out that are pretty exciting, just like the anticipated games that are coming out for the year, and that's it. Hey, I'm Anthony Sadarski. I'm the perspective editor here at the Northern Star, and in today's issue of the Star, we have the final installment of our Clean Slate editorial, which involves uh, the city and their changes with the new mayor coming elections coming up. We also have a column from Anastasia about how she feels social media ruins the common face-to-face -face <laughs> conversations. So be sure to pick it up and check it out.